Hey, how's it going friends? Welcome back to my channel and to another movie reaction. Today I'm gonna be reacting to Outland, which is a Patreon request from our Patreon, Christopher Brown. Thank you so much for requesting this movie and sponsoring this video. So today we have an action sci-fi crime movie and honestly, I've never heard about Outland before. It was released in 1981 and it's starring Sean Connery. That makes me pretty excited. It seems like a very interesting movie. I mean, from the cover and the actor, of course, it seems like a very interesting one but I didn't watch any trailers before and I didn't read the story also and that's why today we're going fully blind with the movie and today I've decided not to use the gaming chairs that I usually use the blue one and the pink one because honestly they're giving me a very painful back uh, pain back the upper back no the middle of the back it is super painful so I've decided to try my editing chair for the for watching the movie uh, because this chair I got it from Ikea I'm gonna try it if it doesn't give me a back pain that would be super cool and like I will use the gaming chairs uh, less times than before it is weird because the gaming chairs are designed for a comfortable sit long sit but mine aren't like very expensive honestly I cannot afford the ones uh, very that are very expensive right now so uh, yeah maybe that's the reason why they aren't very comfortable so yeah today I'm trying a new chair <laughs> so guys before we start watching today's movie let me remind you to subscribe if you're new to the channel and hit the like if you enjoyed this video and also you can check out the link in the description for Patreon if you're interested in the early full reactions and also if you got a specific movie you want me to react to uh, don't forget to check out the link in the description and now let's start watching Outland Sean Connery do you pronounce it Connery or Connery? Hmm. I'm so glad it is sci-fi <laughs> as I've mentioned before I love sci-fi movies by the way, this is the second request from Christopher Brown. Thank you so much again. The first one was Soldier. Honestly, it was super awesome. It became one of my favorite movies. Wow, I like the start of this one. The music is dark. I love dark stuff. <laughs> wow, I really like it. It's giving me a creepy feeling. Outland. Third moon of Jupiter. So it's about space? That is awesome if it's really about space. I still don't understand more than half of these <laughs> writings. I'm not a space expert. I would have guessed if there will be aliens in this movie, but I think not because it is not horror. It is action crime sci-fi. There's not going to be any aliens. The start is kind of slow and this is a problem because it's excited me more. I'm very excited for the start of this movie. Okay, I think it's starting. These are the astronauts. They got lights in the helmets. First time I see this kind of uh, helmet. Is it called helmet? They're doing some tough work. Spiders. A spider? Really? Spider? Is he imagining? Please believe him. Please believe him. <gasps> really? Oh my god! <gasps> wow, that was too sudden. Oh. <laughs> I'm still shocked. <laughs> but it seems like a very nice movie. <laughs> I'm sure he was like imagining there's a spider. Oh, and remember, seven pages of math. I promise. I hate math. <laughs> She's worried after hearing that. Seems like she got a bad feeling. Two weeks. It'll get better. I promise. Two weeks. Are they in space also? She got a bad feeling. It's like she's saying goodbye for the last time. <gasps> I feel like something bad will happen. Super bad will happen here. And all of these employees, because there are so many of them. Yeah, all of them will be dead. Oh, that would be horrible. Well, I've got to get to know you. And now you've got to get to know me. Hmm, he's new. Pretty soon I'll see that this is just like every other mining town. There's never much trouble. I'm glad to hear it. <laughs> <laughs> Drop by my office. We'll talk some more. This guy is suspicious. 
Working in space is really dangerous. Gotta give it to them, the ones who do it. They're really brave and hard workers. This guy lost it. <gasps> Something wrong with him. What's got into him? Whoa. <gasps> he went without a suit. It's like he's being controlled. Zero atmosphere. Oh shit. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> wow. <laughs> There's something very interesting going on. He was like he's being controlled. And the first one was like hallucinating. He saw a spider. I don't know what's going on. I despise these message things. I'm just such a coward. If you were in front of me, I'd change my mind. Okay, what did you do? He's a child. He's never set foot on Earth. Never. Horrible. Not good for his health. Don't you see he deserves Poor child. a childhood? He deserves a chance to breathe air. Real, outside air. Yeah, please understand her. She got a point. She made the right decision. I hope he understands. Did he leave a note? None that we know of, sir. Then how do you know it was a suicide? Yeah. There's no other explanation. I mean, he, he knew what he was doing, that's for sure. Yeah, they saw him smiling also. Who the hell ordered all these pressure packs? This is a mine, not a war. You did, Doctor. I said 100, not 1,000. You said 1,000. I said 100. <laughs> Are you Dr. Lazarus? Yes, take two aspirin and call me in the morning. That's a doctor joke. Are you the new marshal? <laughs> I like that joke. I'm not a psychiatrist, I can't tell you why. This doctor is mean. I would like a report of all of these incidents that have happened during the past six months. I'd like it really soon. Or I might just kick your nasty ass all over this room. That's a martial joke. Oh, <laughs> he got back at her. Yeah, you better do it. So there are a lot of incidents in just six months. It is something sus. I'm glad he's looking into it sooner than later. These beds are like cages. Kind of creepy. Good thing they got curtains for some privacy. Yo, yo, what are you doing? <gasps> what is that? What is that? I have no knowledge. What is that? It is some kind of, some kind of a drug or something. I don't know. They might explain later. <laughs> you know, the hookers here are nice. Sometimes they can help you when you're lonely. There are hookers here? <laughs> I get the feeling I'm bombing. Seriously? Oh, bad. I just can't take it anymore. I'll be right there. What's going on? <laughs> the same guy who injected himself with something. <laughs> Poor hooker. He went nuts. <laughs> Space facilities are so creepy. I don't want to hurt anybody, including you. I hope they manage to rescue the hooker. Seven. Slowly, open it slowly. One. They killed him. Is she gonna be alright? Maybe, if you let me do my job. Wow, this doctor is so mean. 28 in the last six months. 28? Something very weird is going on. And the numbers are increasing fast. Faster than before. Because in the first six, mo six months, there were only two, and now there are like 20. How many she said? 26? 24? 28? Something like that. They started investigating. I think they should send some investigators from Earth. But they won't believe him. They're gonna say there's just uh, incidents. This is too dark and creepy. He shouldn't do it alone. What are you doing? <gasps> oh, don't mess with that. What are you doing? Oh, he's taking a blood for some blood tests. Right? Probably. Yeah. This is the doctor? Yeah. Hello. Lazarus. You better be dying. <laughs> she got a very tough job. I don't blame her for being this mean. <laughs> no alcohol. Okay. He ate dinner. 
She can tell? Impressive. It's because he didn't eat vegetables. <laughs> vegetables are important. Okay. She found something. What's going on? Tell us. Is it a drug? You just won a prize. What kind? Some kind of narcotic. A drug. Bingo. Okay, what? Polydichloric euthamol. Huh? It's an amphetamine. Strongest thing you ever saw. Makes you feel wonderful. You do 14 hours of work in six hours, that kind of nonsense. Oh! Especially manual labor. It makes you work like a horse. Wow! Then it made them psychotic. <gasps> and then it fries your brain. Oh my gosh. It has to have been shipped in. <gasps> oh, someone's given it to, to them. The workers are producing more, but the company's making bigger profits. Oh, that would make the company so evil if it is really true. Two. Of drug-related crime. Shepard, that's the one. Nicholas B. They got a club in space? He's looking for the guys, isn't he? That is the same guy walking around they showed him before. These two are evil. Wow, they got all sorts of entertainment here. <laughs> that is impressive. This is no place for heroes. You try to bust him, you're messing with more than you think. I say he shouldn't trust this guy. He shouldn't tell him. This guy, he is connected with more than just the company. Hmm. I mean it. There's some serious stuff involved. He cannot bring him or them down by himself. I don't want you. I want him. Does he have a plan? It won't be easy, you know, to bring him down. So this is the case. Shepard is selling this weird thing to workers. That's why they're losing their minds. Yeah, keep your eye on that guy. He gave it to him. Busted. <gasps> What's he gonna do? Oh, he wanna catch him red-handed. <gasps> oh, oh, why did he see him? Where are you running to? <laughs> you can't get away. It is too crowded. <laughs> Makes it very hard to chase. This place is like limited. I don't know where he's running. Show his leg. See, there's nowhere to go. This guy is a psycho! He wanted to fry him! Come on, O'Neill! Come on! No! <gasps> Everyone's watching. Think it over. This guy is a fighter. I got a hand it to you. You're pretty sharp. See your own tough guy. Nobody talks to him. Nobody touches him. I mean nobody. You understand? I understand. He understands, but is he gonna listen? What a nice cell. <laughs> a pure torture, which he deserves. Mm. Try and meddle, I want you to know what you're meddling with. You got something to prove, prove it to yourself, not to me. I'll see you around. If you're looking for money, you're smarter than you look. If you're not, you're a lot dumber. I'm probably a lot dumber. That can be very dangerous. <gasps> He's threatening him. Now this and the bad guy's got an eye on him. They will hurt him. I'm sure there's more than one or two. <gasps> what? <gasps> I think Shepard killed him, so he won't talk. Oh my god! <gasps> they killed him! It's O'Neill's turn now. He should be careful. <gasps> that was too soon. <gasps> Maybe he's faking. Yes! Smart! <gasps> oh my gosh, they're hiding it here? Now what's he gonna do? He can't do anything about it if he's alone. He needs some help. He recorded it. Tell them not to worry. How good are the men? The best. They've left on the shuttle arriving Sunday. They have their own weapons? Yes. 
this. <gasps> With weapons? Don't worry. He's a dead man. Oh no! Oh my god, what's he gonna do? Good thing his wife left with her son. Otherwise, he would have threatened him to kill his family. Creepy space. So this guy is a replacement for the previous one. I hope he doesn't get killed. How many can I count on? Well, uh, I don't know, sir. What about you? We have families. I have a family. At least he was honest. 19 hours left. Does he have a plan? It seems like he's really setting up a plan. His wife? The reservation's up at three. <gasps> that was thoughtful. It's your chance to go. I love you. Tell her you love her too. You're going to see many wonderful things. Like what? Wars, maybe? <laughs> they put you to sleep for more than a year. That's true. Just like an alien and aliens. He feels like this is really the last call with his family. I hope he survives. He's a really good guy, that's why he can't leave. They arrived earlier. I could use a little help. I thought so. No one wanna help. I'm in a shit. His man got families. I'm starting to get worried. I feel so much hate for this guy. Weapons. Are those sniper uh, weapons or something else? No, not snipers. He set up a plan. I'm sure it's gonna work. The fire alarm. <laughs> I hope it's not serious. Okay, it stopped. Whoa! Oh, they got some advanced weapons. That was close. Did he get shot? <gasps> what? They took his weapon. How did they find it? Who did this? <gasps> He's bleeding. They're gonna trace the blood. I don't see hope for him. Jesus, take it easy. <gasps> what the hell are you doing? Lazarus. They've missed the artery. Come on, I'll stop the bleeding. Oh my god, she's gonna help him. <laughs> she turned out to be super, super awesome. She's the only one who's gonna help him. The rest are a bunch of cowards. I'm sure she got a family as well. So this is really brave of her. Please be careful. I feel like she's now my favorite character. <laughs> uh, I hope she's gonna be okay. He went outside? Outside where? Mm. Seal the doors, yes. The door is sealed, bitch! <laughs> Go back! Ah, this is from the outside. Oh, I think I get it now. Now she's gonna lock him in and then he's gonna strike from outside, but I don't know how. <laughs> we'll see. Lazarus, please, hurry! Yes! This is the end of you. <gasps> he exploded. Should I feel sorry for him? He's just an assassin doing his job. <laughs> now the second guy. That was a very nice plan. Very smart. Let's see the fate of the second guy. <laughs> O'Neill couldn't have done it without her. She was a huge help for him. <gasps> Can I help? Oh. <laughs> that was scary. Is the marshal all right? So far. Is he gonna help? Outside where? Maybe in the greenhouse. I don't feel good about Sergeant. I feel like he's gonna he's working with the bad guys now. I don't feel I can trust him. I don't know. It's all ruined! Oops! Bye! Wow! Oh! <laughs> what a horrible end! He did it! Are there more? What a creepy atmosphere in space. 
Sergeant, he's no good. I knew it. This is probably the final battle. He should stay still. Oh, yes, please pull him. <laughs> Oh, he's injured also, which makes it worse. Ah, uh, push him. No. Come on. Oh. <sighs> O'Neill survived. That is the most important thing. Surprise. Punch him. Oh, fuck. Yay! <laughs> he shouldn't be killed. He should be thrown in prison to suffer forever. That's, I think, more harsh. He's gonna go back to Earth. I'm so glad he's okay. I was on my way to drinking myself into a stupor and I thought I'd drop in and say goodbye. Oh, he's leaving. Well, better for him and for his family. You were a good friend. Mm. Thank you. A great friend. There hasn't been so much excitement in this heap for some time. <laughs> it entertains her. Oh, <laughs> he's gonna go back with them. <laughs> I don't know why I got the chills because of the song. It's over. It's over. Oh, <laughs> that was a hell of a movie. Honestly, guys, this is so, so awesome. I loved it so much. Uh, Sean Connery's performance was outstanding and i'm really happy that he managed to survive and get the bad guys um i had doubts at first because it seemed hopeless but with the help of the doctor lazarus it was possible she was a great help as i've mentioned she's she became my favorite character in the movie she's so awesome again thank you so much christopher brown for requesting this movie you got a really awesome taste i gotta say this one and soldier both are really really awesome and i think we've reached the end of today's reaction as i've said i really enjoyed this movie i I've, I've enjoyed my time so much today i hope you did too guys and if you did don't forget to leave a like and check out the links in the description and i'll catch you in another movie reaction have a great day guys bye